I have won two national Kudo tournaments and I've also been selected to represent India at the Kudo World Cup. Now, a lot of people came up to me and congratulated me for this achievement. However, I noticed something that was common among all of them and it was that they were all completely unaware of what Kudo was. They would ask me if what I did was either Judo or UFC. Well, to put it quite plainly, no it isn't. I am into a sport called Kudo and today I will tell you what Kudo really is. So, what is Kudo? Kudo is an official Japanese cultural Budo sport. Your Budo refers to the martial way. Kudo is a mixed martial art. It is a safe, scientific, modern and practical combination of Karate, Judo, Jiu-Jitsu, Muay Thai and Kickboxing. It comprises full contact punches, throws and submission techniques on the ground. Now whenever we think of any martial art such as Karate, Judo, Taekwondo etc. We always think of it in a very competitive sense, right? Like it is always about the competition? Well, Kudo as a martial art is way more than just a competitive sport. Kudo is a lifelong sport, a system of youth education, a method of self-defense and a way to maintain health for both adults and children alike. Along with this, it also stresses upon respect and etiquette in its tradition. In this sense, it is a modern Budo that has already spread in more than 60 countries around the world. Kudo is recognized by over 10 national Olympic committees and has over 50 member countries around the world. The late Grand Master Azuma Takashi became a 3rd degree black belt in Judo as well as a 4th degree black belt in Kyokushin Karate recognized the potential for a hybrid martial art which would not be restricted by the boundaries of a single style but would use techniques from various martial arts namely Judo and Karate. In the late 1980s and early 90s, the style began to incorporate various techniques from Muay Thai, Boxing, Jiu Jitsu, Sambo, Submission Wrestling and other martial arts. One of the fundamental goals of Kudo was the creation of a versatile and realistic fighting style without compromising on safety. The late Grand Master created a style which incorporated various offensive as well as defensive techniques which included punches to the head, elbow strikes, headbutts, judo throws, jiu-jitsu joint locks and other standing and ground fighting techniques. Now let's understand which are the main organizations and associations heading Kudo in India. Kifi Association, also known as the Kudo International Federation India, is the governing body for Kudo in India. It was established on the 19th of October 2011 under the aegis of Jukujo Takashi Azuma and Shihan Akshay Kumar. The Kudo Revolution was started in India by Shoshihan Mehul Vora, the president of the Kifi Association, on the eve of the third Akshay Kumar International Invitational Karate Do tournament. The mission statement of Shoshihan Mehul Vora and the Kifi Association is to promote Kudo in its purest form across every village, town and city of India and to create world champions in Kudo. Kifi Association is recognized by the Ministry of Youth Affairs and Sports Government of India as the one and only National Sports Federation for Kudo in India. The Kudo International Federation, also known as the KIF, Japan, is the world headquarters of Kudo. It is an international organization which maintains the development of Kudo as a Budo sport in over 50 countries around the world and was presided over by Jukocho Takashi Azuma, the founder of Kudo, and now by Shihan Hideyeki Takahashi. Kudo as a sport has completely changed my life. Not only has it taught me the importance of self-defense, but it has also taught me the importance of self-discipline and respect in my life. 
and so to end i must say learn kudo love kudo live kudo thank you